get away with on stage at distance. Yes. On film, just looks jerky and yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, brain. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. He's got a nice wobble. He's very relaxed. Hi. I'm like, it's like, it's like sort of. Hi. What's coming in? This present does not. I have some jobs for you to do. I want you to clean and light the kitchen range. Then lay the tables, empty the slot buckets, scrub the steps, polish the boots, and change the beds. And so this is. And this is a this is a two part resin. Yeah. Two equal parts mix it together. This is made from a resin. Yeah, it's a resin. The bodies are generally wood. Yeah. And arms and, and but the hands and the heads are resin. And, Probably the tops of the bodies and most of them are as well. Yeah, yeah. Who does the clothing? I do that as well. Well, yeah. that <laughs> is, yeah, it's superb. I'll do a little demo for you if you want. Sure, sure. Here we go. And wh what's his name? This is the merchant from the Beauty and the Beast place. Right, hello. Who are you taking a bow? The Muppets. Uh, yeah, the Muppets, very good. Characters, yeah. Ah, hello. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> uh, has he got a name? I just call him Blue Monster. The Blue Monster? Yeah, yeah. And these were manufactured so they could they could take the features off. Yeah. And be something different. Do the different of nose? Of course. Yeah, right. yeah you see, so... You know, we've done we've done the how does he smell joke today so yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then and then of course you can you can take take the, his ears the, off the headdresses and the head and change those, yeah. they're great fun aren't they yeah these were these were part of uh, we made a hundred of them all together for wow. the local schools yeah um I think to help with the communication problems yeah. that some of some of the young children were having yeah so they basically take a, a blank muppet yeah and they can choose a set of eyes, yeah. and a nose, and a costume, yeah. and uh, and and make the character that they might feel most comfortable with. Sure, sure. Oh, that's all right. Well, that. Doing this thing. Very good. So you've got to have a bit of skill for that, Glenn. Well, I, I don't know, really. It's, yeah. It's, it's not a unique puppet to me, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Hello you. Teddy, Hello. how are you, yeah, good morning. <laughs> Want him to walk towards you? Yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> you look at his mouth, I've got it rigged and it would appear to be working. Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay. Who's this? I'm April. Actually, she's little April. I'm April. You're April. Yes. And she's little April. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> and who are you going to play today, Mrs. April? I, well, I, I just knew. I'm the princess. You are. And large April. Who are you playing? Large. Today? Large. Sorry. I didn't I'm the that. Queen of Hearts. <laughs> Off with your head. <laughs> Oh no! It's terrible! I'm not! Oh, do let me have it to undo it! I shall do no such thing! You insist on my talking such David, it, how's it all gone? How's it all gone? The weather's been brilliant. It has. Yes. And we uh, thought it was going to rain all day today. I think... Not a drop. To be honest with you, 
I had my doubts and when we started the parade uh, up on the uh, station road here and I thought nobody's turned out yeah and then we got across the road just onto the high street and I looked down and I thought wow where did all these people come from yeah, yeah. and the parade was just beyond my imagination it worked yeah. out far better than I expected yeah. um, but uh, <laughs> but no no I, apparently he was delighted and I think the thing is it's like a lot of the children who'd made the puppets in the workshop on the um, market square Melvin yeah. Yeah. And they came up, and because they saw who I was as the organizer yeah. with this shirt on, yeah. um, they came to look what I've made. And yeah. so many people of the children have come up, genuinely come up, and said thank you very much. Well, I heard somebody say, I've never seen so many smiling faces. Yeah, it's great, and, and it's and great to see the children and the grown ups as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, we certainly had a laugh. Yes, yes. <laughs> After two busy days, we have Alice in Wonderland here, uh, celebrating at the end. Your name was? Colette. Colette and? Tim. Tim. We've got a bit of footage of you both. Well done. And where have you come from? Uh, we're from a, a little town called High Bentham. It's on the um, and North Yorkshire Lancashire border up by Lancaster. Oh. Well, well done you two. And uh, nice of you both to come to Stone. Yes, it's, uh, it's a treat to learn about new places. It seems a very nice place. It is a nice place. Yes. I think everyone is quite friendly. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. What have you got here? I've got Virgil from Thunderbirds. Yes, I saw you with Virgil. And your name? Glo Tharagood. Glo Tharagood. Now, so you all belong to a certain group. Um, um, the Super Mario Nation Recreation. Yes, yeah. Which is trying to keep alive the old methods of doing the Thunderbirds style puppetry. Yeah, yeah. Well, I thought, I thought all the sets were brilliant. Yeah. They're gorgeous, and, uh, aren't they? They are. Fantastic, yeah, yeah. yeah. And so where did you come from? Most of us came, well, four of us came from High Wycombe. Yeah. Three of us and a hanger-on. A long way. Yeah, a reasonably long way. Yeah, yeah. Um, Two came from Sheffield and two came from Cardiff. Yeah, so this is Parker, this is Captain Scar. Yep. This yep. was and the whole the of the Tracy walls. Lounge, yeah. apart from the two that got left on the dining room table in High Wycombe by somebody. Oh, really? <laughs> um, yeah. 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 Have you but yourself? still, absolutely had a ball. Brilliant. And, and Stone? What do you think of Stone? It's a lovely little place. And I mean, it, you know, because it's a lovely little place, it's yeah. not too big. Yeah. Because big places, you get lost. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, brilliant. Yeah. Do it again well, next year. I think I think we all thank you for coming. And uh, our we're pleasure. All, we've yeah. all enjoyed it. Yeah, it's Thanks been for great. Coming. Yeah, yeah, our pleasure. Okay. I'm Peter Charlton. I'm chairman of the British Puppet and Model Theatre Guild. Oh, it's been lovely. Yeah, beautiful weather. Uh, it, beautiful weather, but what is nice, you do, you go to puppet festivals sometimes and uh, you don't really know there's a festival going on. Yeah. You know, but you do, a, you go and see a show or you do a show, whatever, um, and there's nothing else visible. Yeah. You know, there's no feeling or something. This was a real puppet festival. That there were puppeteers talking to other puppeteers, seeing other people's shows. When you've done yours, you can nip round the corner and see somebody else's. But we're a bit like that, you know. We, 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 if we're not performing ourselves, we just want to watch other people perform. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. And uh, it's been marvellous to have you here. And I think everybody in Stone is very thankful for what's happened this weekend. Well, we puppeteers are very happy to have spent our weekend in Stone. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Jamie. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, Matthew. Yeah. Okay. So, the last two days, have you enjoyed the puppet festival? Oh, it's been fantastic. Yeah. It really has. I mean, beautiful weather, which always helps. I know. I thought it was going to bucket down today. Yeah, I know. It was. Uh, it's been lovely, hasn't it? Yeah. And it's it's just been amazing when you get a bunch of people together who've got a vision. They, you know, they really want to do something for the town. Yeah. It just shows what you can achieve, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. And, and it's Saturday especially, you know, right from early on with the parade. It was packed out. It was so busy and yeah. such a wonderful atmosphere. Yeah. And something like that, 
you know, put stone on the map, doesn't it? I know it a lot does. of people yeah. travelled in um, to to sample what was going on, and it, it was just thoroughly enjoyable. Yeah. I had a smile, you know, massive smile on my face from yeah. first uh, to last. Well, I think, so. and I think all the all the shops in Stone were extremely busy, and I think it, yeah, it, something like that gives the whole town centre a lift, doesn't it? Yeah, it um, generally, yeah. And this was a one-off event. Well, hopefully there'll be more. Yeah. But I think as a town, we need to think of how can we do maybe smaller versions of this and bring really new and exciting things into the town. Yeah. So that every Saturday, not yeah. just farmers market Saturday, but every yeah. Saturday and other days are like that. Yeah. Bustling, fun, a sense that Stone's a great place to be. Yeah. And you know, it can be done. It, it was shown on Saturday and Sunday. But Saturday especially, that if you've got people who care about the town, who really want to do something positive, the town gets behind it, yeah. and then that that just escalates. So, uh, yeah, loads more puppet festivals, please. Yeah, it's all gone. Hi Matthew, um, we think it's gone very well. We had yeah. we've had some very positive feedback from um, everyone who's watched the shows. We've had some positive feedback from the uh, shops. We've yeah. said that they've seen a lot of uh, sales going on. So all round, I think it's been very good for Stone.